Business Model Canvas. This is the strategic tool used for quick visualization of your startup business. To quickly visualize and assess the idea or a concept of a startup, it defines many things related to your customer base, cost structure and revenue streams. We will see the components of Business Model Canvas. It is a one-page document to assess and describe the startup or idea. Now, what are the components of BMC? BMC is the abbreviated form. In the components we have key activities, key resources, value proposition, customer segments, customer relationship for a long-term basis, sales channels, key partners, cost structures and revenue streams. How we can make money from it. So this is the business model canvas. The template is attached. You can download and practice it. First, in the top, we have a title slot for startup name and the designer, most probably he's the owner, the CEO. Starting with the value proposition section. It defines that what value you are providing or creating to the customer base. It defines your unique solution. Value propositions can be either quantitative or qualitative. Like the example given in this template, it's an app that tells you about the parking spaces and connects you to your nearest mall location. So the value is availability of parking spaces. Now coming to the key activities, what key activities you have to perform? These should be relevant to the other sections of your BMC. The three main categories of key activities are production, problem solving, and third, creating the platform or a network. In this case, we are creating a platform. So list down all the key activities that you have to perform to solve the problem. Next, we have key resources. It is about the main inputs. What kind of resources do you need? As we have discussed in the resource gathering lecture, either human resources, financial, technical, etc. Now in the leftmost, we have key partners. Key partners are the authorities that are connected directly or indirectly to your startup. Coming to the channels, what channels you are using to reach out to the customer base? There are two types of channels, own channels and partner channels. The channels can be a website, social media, a distribution channel, retail, etc. The customer relationship is straightforward. The type of relationship to the customer. How you will interact with your customers. Some of the type are personal assistance, dedicated services, community and co-creation. Next is, and it's the most important, that is customer segment. Who is your target market? Some of the types are targeting niche markets, general or mass market, diversified customers, etc. In the below one, we have two very important sections, cost and revenue streams. Let's take the cost structure first. Here we will have to list down all the costs associated with our startup. Just look into your key resources, activities and partners, direct or indirect associated costs. In the last one, we have revenue streams, how we are going to generate money. Here you should describe how you will earn revenue from your value propositions. There are several types of revenue streams. Some of them are recurring based, one-time payments, sales, asset sales, usage fee, licensing fee, advertising, etc. There are some limitations of business model canvas as it is the quick summary. So not everything can be adjusted like the details are missing. No competition detail, no depth, no possible risk details, marketing and sales plan missing, also no business plan. But it is good to have a general idea or a quick summary of the startup and that is necessary. I hope that things are clear now. Let's meet in the next lecture about business frameworks.